Yeah, welcome to my video. Uh, here we have a tree that is leaning. It is not straight. As you can see very clearly, there are situations I and mean, times when we encounter this kind of tree in the field. If it were to be straight, it would have come this way. But now it is leaning. How do we do the measurement of diameter? That's what we want to look at in this video. So what you do is your standard breast height stick. You place it. Now, it would be wrong to do like this and say, okay, from ground to here you measure. No, that would be wrong. Or maybe say it like this and you look at this parallel position and say this breast height position. That is wrong. In forest measurements, the way we handle leaning trees is to measure our 1.3 meter position along the lean. You know? So this is where the breast height position will be now. It is along, not this way. So that is something to note. So put it here, and then not here not on this side you bring it right to this side and just make it that way so that's our breast height position now when you are measuring the diameter at this position you also don't measure it uh, let me wind this a little to illustrate to make a good point here okay when measuring the diameter at breast height from this position, you don't, it is wrong to do it this way. I hope you can see what I am saying, okay. It is wrong to do it this way. What I mean by this is, to just cut it straight this way, perpendicular to the ground. That will be wrong. Don't forget what I said earlier. The measurements should be perpendicular to the tree axis, not to the ground level. So since the tree axis is this way, as you can see, this is how it comes. It didn't come this way. So our measurements of diameter will also run through that way so that it will be perpendicular to this axis here. So perpendicular to the axis will mean this way, not this way. You don't make it perpendicular to the ground. Rather, it should be perpendicular to the tree axis. So this will be the correct way to measure this diameter here. And all you need to do is just to roll your tape all through that way and make sure it's yes that way so from our zero point which is here and this is 19 point seven as you can see using that zero point one of the mistakes people make in measurement also is because they can easily see 20 here some may just make the mistake to think that it is 20.123 and say it's 20.3 that is wrong because you read this way and not that way so this is actually 19.7 that's the correct diameter at that point so that is how to measure trees that are leaning now in the next video i'll be showing you another condition that we can encounter in the forest and how to do it join me in the next video